Hey guys, Fahad Zaman here. If we talk about USB drives, we use them to transfer data from one system to another. We can transfer almost everything like photos, videos, music, movies, software or any other file type. However, do you know there are many things a USB drive can do other than just storing data? So in this video, I will share top 5 things you can do with a USB flash drive. Apart from storing and transferring data, you can also increase RAM using USB flash drive. RAM plays an important role in every user's computer as the more RAM means more speed and faster your system's speed. You can use your USB as a RAM in Windows 7, 8 and 10. First insert your USB drive into your computer. Now right click on your USB drive and open properties. Now click on ready boost tab then switch to use this device and reduce your current memory space reduce it with approx 200 to 300 MB then click on apply button and all done now you can use your USB as a RAM in case if you want to change back your USB drive to normal then simply delete it or switch it back Don't use the device in ready boost tab. You can also run portable application from a USB flash drive. A portable app is a computer program that doesn't need to be installed into windows like traditional apps. So you can carry it with you on a portable device or cloud drive and use on any windows computer. Portableapps.com is a website that allows Windows user to run any app from your USB drive itself. You just need to carry a suite of all applications like Chrome, VLC, etc. all on the drive to run it on any remote computer. Well, we usually log into the computer by using our passwords and pins. However, do you know you can use your USB pen drive to lock and unlock your computer? There is a software like Predator which let users lock their PC using the USB flash drive. First of all, download and install the software Predator. First of all, download and install the software Predator on your computer. Now it will ask you to set password and recovery key. Here you can set any password of your choice. Now your USB is ready to use. Now every time you log on your computer, you just insert the USB and launch the software and stay back and do your work and after your work remove it, your computer will get automatically locked. Our USB drive may contain some sensitive data that we might not to share with anyone. So with this implementation, you will be securing your data with a password that needs to be entered every time you insert that drive into the computer. The feature is by default available in Windows operating system and you just have to follow some steps. First of all, insert USB pen drive into your computer. Now right click on the drive and select turn on BitLocker. Now enter the password you want to set in both the password fields. Now click on next and next and print or save the key for future reference. Now encryption process will start and your drive will get secured with the password that you have set. You can use USB flash drive to install a Windows operating system onto a computer. Using a USB flash drive is useful when your computer does not have a CD drive or when you don't have an operating system installation disk. Insert a USB flash drive into your computer. The USB flash drive should be at least 8GB in space so that it can accommodate most operating system installation files. In search, type command prompt. Type in disk part and then press enter. 
Find your USB flash drive name, letter or size in gigabytes to identify it. The flash drive is usually the bottom disk in this menu. Type select disk number into command prompt. Make sure to replace number with the flash drive's number as presented in the list. And the press enter. Type in clean and then press enter. Type create partition primary and press enter. Type select partition 1 and press enter. Type in active and press enter. Type format space fs is equal to fat32 space quick into command prompt and then press enter. Type in assign and press enter. Your USB drive is no bootable, meaning that you can copy the Windows files in USB drive in order to install it on computer. Please note never paste these files into a folder, just copy and paste all the files into USB drive. After it restart your PC and go to BIOS option, find the boot order section, move the flash drive to the top of the list and that's it. So that's all for now, if you guys enjoyed this hit the like button, comment down below if you have any question, subscribe to our channel for more amazing tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.